Alright guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I want to show you guys on how to redeem and use PR Proxy Sox 5, okay? Most of you have been asking me, how can I use this PR Proxy, all of those things? Calm down, calm down. Today, let me show you how you can use it effectively, okay? So, if you find value in this video, make sure you subscribe, like and follow for more updates like this, okay? So, I will search right here, PR Proxy, sign up, right? Okay. You don't need to turn on your VPN to do all of these things. You don't need to do anything. You understand? You don't need any of this. Okay. So Peer Proxy is a, a website that gives you dynamic proxies. You understand? Though, don't go for their any of their proxy. I will just show you how you can redeem your CD key. You understand? Your CD key. That as well. You are not buying any proxy from their website directly because if you buy proxy from them, you are likely to lose your money. Okay. So, um, I'll just, this is right, so I'll just tap on it like this. Alright, now they'll bring us to this interface, right? So, they tell us to log in our account, okay, or register. So, I'll just click on register down here, okay? So, I'll click on register. Uh, sorry. So, right now, I'll put in my email, my password, and invitation code. I don't have in the invitation code, so there's no need of that, okay? so i'll put in everything right all right i've registered successfully so it's loading up like this it's loading up so let's see how it goes so these are is the interface is right so let me just save this okay so uh now it will bring us to this interface right just scroll down right scroll down then click on this residential ips right i think uh just let's just scroll down first then click on this ox5 here is ox5 right Let's click on this ox5 okay save all right now you have click on source 5 it will bring you to this interface i see so the minimum amount you can buy on this website is 200 ips you understand 200 ips but if you have a vendor like me that you can buy a pr proxy from you can actually buy from 20 10 30 40 50 okay one IP might last you, let's say, 12 hours, some might last you 8 hours, some might last you 24 hours, you understand? Based on the way, when you activate an IP address, the way it works is that when you pick an IP address, if you buy, let's say, you buy 20 IPs and you pick one IP address, you understand? When you pick one and you use it, let's say you choose UK, because you can actually choose any country you want, you understand? When you pick one IP and you use it, when it reaches the time to expire, let's say it will expire in 12 hours, it will expire, you need to go and Pick another one inside your, inside your 19 that is remaining on your dashboard. You understand? When you pick another one, it remains 18. So when that one expires, you still go and pick another one. You understand? So sometimes 30 IPs might last you 20 days, some it can last you 30 days. Depends on your luck. You understand? So now you want to redeem, click on these three lines up here, right? Click on it. Then, uh, okay, go to proxies. Go to proxies. Let's see. Okay, go to. So five proxies. Oh, okay. All right. Um, they told me to verify my email address, so I'll go ahead and verify my email address right now. All right, guys. I'll verify my account. So, how do you get here? How I get get here is you probably come to your account section, right? Um. Okay. I think so. This is where I clicked so that you guys will understand me. This place, this is my email address, right? I clicked on it, you understand? So when I clicked on it, automatically brings me to this, uh, sorry, bring me to this interface. So on this interface, just scroll down, just make sure your uh, your toggle is here, so it's five proxies, you understand? Don't go and buy their starting residential proxy that is $5 monthly. It is very, very bad, very, very bad. Okay, I've tried many of these proxies, so if you want, Coach on proxy, you can meet me. I have I have spent a lot of money, more than 100k on just proxies. So I know all of those things. Very very bad proxies. Okay, if you want to get a good proxies, I recommend Jonix. You understand? But but if you want IPs, they have IPs. Yeah, you can use their IPs. It's very very good. Very very good. You understand? So now this is where they say redeem CD key. You understand? This is where you put the CD key. Okay, now I'll go and generate a CD key and come back to you guys, so you guys will see. Um, how CD key works, okay? So let me go right now. All right, uh, now I've I've gone to generate a CD key. So this is CD key, right? 
Now, if I use the Siri key, nobody can use it again. Even you can use it again because whenever I use once, it is it has expired. You understand? It has expired. Okay. So now I'll just click on confirm, right? I'll just click on confirm. So now I've confirmed. Now as you can see right here, it says successfully used. I see successfully used. So now how do I know? How do I get my CD key? Like how many IPs I have right now? Let me check. All right, guys. So um, now I clicked on this place, right? So when you click on this place, you want to check how many IPs you have. So when you click on it, it will automatically bring you to this interface, right? As you can see, I have um, let it load, let it load. I have five IPs, right? So now next time I want to redeem um, another one, so I'll just put the info here. Then I'll click on confirm. Understand? Then it will load up another IP right here. Okay. So now, how do you use it? The way you use it is that you click on this Android. Since I'm using an Android phone, I can also use it on my laptop and even my iPhone. But I'm not sure of iPhone. You understand? So when you tap on it like this, it will automatically download an app for you. You understand? Tap on it to download an app for you. So now I already have the app downloaded on this browser. So I'll go to download. Then as you can see, this is peer group, right? Peer group. So I'll tap on it like this. Then uh, allow settings. Uh, okay, sorry. Okay, where is it? Let me scroll down. Uh, okay, so give it like this. So I'll install it like this. So it's installing. Let's wait for it to load up. So I would open the app, right? I'll open the app. So that this is the app. Now it's asking me to log in my details. So I'll log in my details right now. So I will log in my account, right? So now I've logged in my account. Okay, I've logged in my account. As you can see, I have five IPs right here. I have five IPs. This is how the interface looks like. Now, how do you connect a proxy? As you can see, all this info are blank because I've not connected any proxies. So now how do I connect? Go to this proxy section, right? Tap on it. Then uh okay. Proxy list. Now okay, let's wait. Alright, this is where I clicked. Proxy list, right? When you tap on it like this, then it will bring in the interface. Now if I want to connect to a US proxy, I'll just tap on this one like this. But uh let me search for another country and see country i'll just united kingdom first united kingdom let's see how it goes okay i give it space and that same popular proxies coming all right as you can see this is the united kingdom proxies right when you click on long acting ISPs, as you can see, so this is a, this is Wisdom Cloud. This is not a good ISP as for me. This is not like a good ISP. So I will just scroll down and see if I can see another one. You understand? So um, okay, I think we will use US for this tutorial because US are very very many. So let me choose this US product. Let's say please. Please purchase IP first. Okay, hold on. Let me go back. I think I'm doing a mistake right here. Okay. All right. Um. Sorry. So this is where my IP is. As you can see, I have five IPs right here. I'm just doing some mistakes. Since so, um, now how do you choose IP that is based on this place, right? This one, this one, this one. I don't have any IPs here. I don't have any IPs here. You understand? So what do I do? I'll just click on proxy list. As you can see, this is the one I bought. You understand? I didn't buy this one. I didn't buy this one. So then I'll choose an ISP, ISP from this place. You understand? I'll choose an ISP from this place. So now I will choose a US ISP, right? Choose a US ISP. So this is a US ISP, right? As you can see, these are all the details, right? These are all the details, right here. You understand? So now, if I connect to this proxy now, automatically the style starts counting. You understand? Till it's expired. That's why you need to use a proxy till the expires. So if you're tired, you just go and sleep. You understand? If you're into survey. So now, not connected, right? I will connect it right now. 
all right it's a connecting now it is connected right this serves as like a proxy for you guys so i'll go to my um ip score right i'll go to ip score dot io let's say it goes score dot io right so let's see how it goes okay all right as you can see so this is a residential proxy as you can see this is a residential proxy at us proxies but the frost code is quite high but sometimes frost code doesn't determine that the proxy isn't good i'll list you guys you understand if you check your own your own isp your own like we are in nigeria right check your pro mtn yourself check the frost code you will know and you are still using your phone to browse you are using it for many things you understand so it's not that it's not a problem so it's a residential proxy that's my own here yeah. so that's how to use a peer vpn if you don't understand anything kindly check me on telegram i'll put my telegram link below this video okay and if you want a good proxy that you don't need to be changing ip and i just use geonix you understand i recommend you to you guys okay so and if you need to see the key for this particular peer proxy or night to proxy you can check me out on telegram okay so see you on the next one peace out